how to make a man fall in love with you. Let's face it, everyone wants to fall in love at some point. And more importantly, they want someone to fall in love with them. The letter isn't always as easy as it sounds. But fortunately, there are things you can do about this. Once you learn a few simple techniques, you realize how easy it is to make a guy fall in love with you. And the best part is, these are things that most women are naturally very good at. When trying to get a man to notice you and start caring about you, something doesn't always work, but you don't have to go overboard either. Before we get started, if you'd like to know every man's secret obsession, click the link in the description. 1. Always be super nice to him. One of the most common complaints men have when they're in a relationship is that the woman they are with has a bad attitude or simply doesn't smile that often. Just like women, men want to be with someone who smiles, has a great attitude, and is self-confident and fun to be around. You should be super nice to you, guy. You shouldn't be always depressed, always angry, aggressive, arrogant, but just small gestures like, how was your day? Oh, you've come back, welcome. You think bringing him, serving him his food? You know, you should be super nice to your guy. Number two, don't be overly accommodating. Men usually don't like women who are overbearing and over anxious to develop a relationship. Men tend to keep their male friends even when they're in a relationship. Whereas many women start to ignore their friends when they are dating someone. You know, don't be overbearing and anxious to develop a relationship. You will tend to be looking desperate. When you are over accommodating, you become desperate for love and you start following the man, which is a very dangerous aspect. Men don't like desperate women. Men like confident women. Number three, always look your best. Do you have to lose 20 pounds and dye your hair to make a man fall in love with you? Of course not. But you should always look your best. Make sure your hair and clothes are neat and clean. And that you're wearing a nice, a nice outfit every time you see him. You should always look good when you're about to meet the man. You should always be in your best form. You should always smile. You should always be bright. You should always be happy. You should have confidence in your beauty. When you're about to meet your man, <laughs> always listen to him. Let's face it. People talk about themselves, and if you want to love a man to love you, you have to listen to what he has to say. It not only shows him that you are genuinely interested in him, but also gives you the opportunity to learn his dislikes, his likes and dislikes much better. You get to know him more, and he's happy that you're really invested. In trying to know someone because knowing someone it's really a sign that you care about the person you feel for the person you want to know more about him which is very important come up with surprises come up with surprises as number five men like to get surprised by their girlfriend and spouses thereby you can arrange a fantastic candlelight dinner get dressed for him and bring him around to gifts for him such little gestures of love and care would definitely make him fall in love with you all over again because the most important thing is to make your man fall in love with you every day as if it was your first day he met you come up with surprises and he will know that you really care about him you're not in like other girls who are more materialistic and all the like number six laugh a lot when you're around him everyone wants a partner who has a sense of humor so show him yours whenever you're around him. Everybody likes to be around people who make them laugh. But this is especially important when you want someone to fall in love with you. You know, laugh at his small jokes. You should be really happy at his small jokes. You guys should be fun. Ha smiles and, ha and laughter brings happiness. So you should always laugh at his jokes. 
make him re- realize how similar you are to him. If you want the man to fall in love with you, one thing to do is to remind him of how similar the two of you are. If you know he loves music, and you do too, make sure he realizes that this is something the two of you have in common. You know, when a man realizes you're similar to him, he believes you were meant to, to be together, that you guys are compatible. He sees himself in you, and you see yourself in him. So bring up, try to bring up your similarities with him. Oh, I hate lousy people. Oh, that's true. I don't like people who are too lousy. I hate people who are always angry. You know, we are the same. Like, I love the hustle. Oh, I also love the hustle. I love making money. So make him realize how similar you are to him. Let him know what makes you special. Everybody is good at something. And if you have a special talent of area, let him know what it is. If you are a great cook, invite him over for dinner. Show him those skills. If you are good at sports, ask him if he would like to attend a gym or walk out with you in the gym. You know, let him know what makes you special. There's that special thing. If you're good, maybe um, you're good in, 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 in fashion, you make him a dress, create him a particular design. If you're a good artist, draw something for him. If you're good at music, you all should listen to similar music. But let him know what makes you special. If you're a good musician, sing for him. Be a little bit different than other women. We all have stereotypes about the opposite sex. So don't let him think you're just a typical female who doesn't care about anything except makeup and shoes. Show him that you have a mind of your own and you have a wide variety of interests. A wide variety of interests like you love reading, you love challenges, you love sports, or you love healthy healthy living, you're interested in politics, you're interested in finance, you're interested in investing. Be a little bit different. A lot of women be like, no, I love vacations. Oh, I love shoes. I need a new pair of haircut. I need a new pair of bras and blah, 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 and blah, blah, blah. Be a little bit different than other women. Show him you c- he can trust you. Honesty is a must if you want a real relationship with a man. He has to know he can trust you and that you are real. This is another reason why not being a f- Thick is so important. A man has to think of you as honest and trustworthy or he's never going to be attracted to you. Honesty, you can be the most beautiful lady on earth. But if you are, you are a dishonest lady, if you're very cunning, if you're not trustworthy, it will be difficult for a man to be attracted to you. So you should always be honest. 11. Do things for him that won't benefit you. It's always good to do things to help others. When you know you are not going to be getting anything in return, even little things mean a lot when it comes to helping him. In some way, even though you don't personally benefit from the action, normally the definition of helping is helping without expecting anything in return. Do not help a man because you expect him that during your time, he's going to give you helping because of love. Love remains the biggest language. You should love your man. You should help him. You should not do things expecting from him. But do it out of love. You're not trying to invest in something and get a a particular amount of profits back. Because if you're expecting something, like you buy him a shirt so that he buys you a car, you can buy him a shirt on your birthday. On your own birthday, he buys you a breastway. And you get mad. So... Do things for him that wouldn't benefit you. That's all about love. Compliment him whenever you can. It's no secret that men love praise. And if you have a guy, if you give a guy a lot of compliments and praise, he responds in a positive way. This is especially true if you compliment him on doing something that men are especially good at, such as fixing an appliance or changing the oil in a car. You know, compliment does not mean line or you should be truth and honest in your compliment 
Not say him he's more handsome than Brad Pitt or he's more handsome than Justin Bieber or he's the most handsome man on earth. Yeah, even though most handsome man on earth can be good, but you should say if he has a, a nice shirt, oh wow, I love this shirt. It brings out a brighter side of you and a positive side. It's a there's a positive energy coming out from this. You know, look, come up with something. Be patient. Be patient. When you're trying to get a guy for enough of you, it may take some time. After all, even in the best circumstances, it isn't going to happen overnight. It may take months or even years. But the key is not to run out of patience. And if you do run out of patience, don't let him know it. So remember, you should be patient, but don't let him know anything. Be patient because you all have to build a solid love foundation. So be always patient. Never try to change him. If there's one thing that men hate, it's when women expect to change who they are. If the man you're interested in likes to spend $1,000 on baseball cards, don't ostracize him for it. This is obviously something he's deeply passionate about, so just let it be. If a man spends money on video games or on dressing, do not try to hush him down. You can't change him. No matter the efforts you do, you can't change him change a man because there are some habits that are deeply rooted number 15 choose some more ways to show him that you're thinking about him little things mean a lot in a relationship send him texts occasionally to let him know you're thinking about him or send him a surprise greeting card in the mail so he can have a tangible proof that you're thinking of him leave him a sweet note under his windshield wipers or put a post or put a post-it note on his work desk. You know, be creative in your relationship. A lot of women are not creative. Be creative. Surprise him. Make him feel. There are just little things that brighten up his day. There are just little things that make him invest in you. That are little things that make you never want to abandon you. You know, little things. Be very creative in your relationship. Okay, thanks for watching. And don't forget, if you like to know every man's secret obsession, click the link in the description below to know every man's secret obsession. Thank you.